and welcome to today's Tuesday tip. Today's tip will be from Lisa. My question today is concerning the VAWA emergency transfer plan and wanted to know is it necessary to provide a separate wait list for those requests? Hi Lisa. HUD leaves that up to management whether you give a wait list preference to victims of domestic violence or not. If you do have a preference, however, it needs to be stated in your tenant selection plan, your house rules, so that everyone will know there's, and there's no misunderstanding as to why a victim was housed. You also need to document your waiting list with explanations as to why you housed the emergency victim over the next applicant on your waiting list. Whatever management's decision is, it needs to be made public in the tenant selection plan, house rules, policies, and procedures. Thank you. The next one's Kim. My question today is, are there any financial obligations to the property or management associated with the emergency transfer? Hi, Kim. Only those financial fees that are associated with, like any other transfer, the key would be confidentiality. So make sure that you keep all of the information confidential. Thank you for the question, great question.